Hi, this is Michael Orl from MobileBurn.com. I'm here with Dan Seifert. We're on a video chat using the Google Nexus S. I just installed Android 2.3.4 Gingerbread on my device so we could run the new Google Talk video chat capability. So, how's it sound, Dan? Sounds good to me. Uh, your voice and video seem to be pretty well synced up and uh, audio is clear and the video feed is a little pixely but not bad at all. Yeah, okay, let's see. Uh, we've got some on-screen controls here. I'm going to send you a message while here. Can you still see me at the moment? It actually says you've paused at the moment. Okay, so the video is paused, but you still hear me? Yes. Okay. Because I right now I can't see you because I'm in the text messaging part, or not the text messaging, but rather the IM section. So I just sent you an IM. I'm hoping you got that. Let's see what happens when you reply. And there it is. Just said I got it. Popped up on the screen. Very cool. All right, uh, no ability to use the for the rear-facing camera on this. I can mute and unmute and uh, hang up the call. That's about it. Whereas the tablet can use the uh, both cameras, you know, forward-facing and rear-facing, which is a bit strange that they left that out of this function, uh, out of this version of the application rather. So, okay, Dan, we're going to hang up. Thanks for all. Thanks for your time. Thanks, guys. Okay, now I'm going to quickly demonstrate a video call with. Uh, Android Honeycomb device I'm calling in from my Motorola Zoom. It's right there next to me. You can see me right there. How you doing? See, same controls, same uh, on screen texting abilities. And the video quality is not too bad either. So there you have it. It's a quick look at the new video chat capabilities of Google Talk. I'm Michael Oral from MobileBurn.com.